Fire is one of the greatest inventions of humanity. We use it almost every day. But what is fire? I asked few people about it and they answered it is a fourth state of matter, that is plasma. But if you light this candle up, this part, this flame is not plasma. Plasma formation requires very high temperatures. Also there are other means where plasma state of matter occurs without intense temperature. But that should be a different concept altogether. Today let's talk about this glowing part of the flame. When wax in this candle burns, it does not burn clean. It produces smoke. Smoke is basically unburned carbon particles. We call it soot. The reaction of wax with oxygen is exothermic. I mean when oxygen reacts with wax, it produces heat. And if you heat up anything enough, it glows. Look at this fine wire mesh. If I heat it enough, it starts glowing with bright orange red color. So this part of the flame is actually soot particles glowing because of heat. And as they go away from the hot zone, they don't glow. Then we call it smoke. Some materials, when they burn, they do not produce a visible flame. For example, methanol or ethanol or ethyl or methyl alcohol. When ethanol is burnt, it burns very clean and all the carbon is converted into colorless carbon dioxide. I have here ethanol and if I try to burn it with a match, it burns but with invisible flame. The alcohol is burning but without fire. If I put a piece of paper into the fire, you can now observe that it's burning. This is not a pure ethanol, so it's actually burning with barely visible flame. But that flame is not bright enough. You cannot observe its presence in bright light. Now I switch off the lights and adjust the ISO setting of the camera. You can actually observe the pale blue flame. Methanol, on the other hand, burns more clean, hence the flame is not visible. We can actually guess what type of flame a substance will burn with, just by its molecular structure. This is a molecular structure of wax or paraffin wax. It is a long chain molecule and requires very large amount of oxygen to burn. If it is burning in atmospheric air, it doesn't get enough oxygen. It cannot completely burn and emits a lot of unburnt carbon particles or soot. Thus the flame is orange red and produces a lot of smoke. On the other hand, if you see methanol or ethanol, they do not have long chains and get enough oxygen from the atmosphere for their complete combustion. And hence the end product is colorless carbon dioxide. If you compare between ethanol and methanol, Methanol requires even less oxygen to burn. So it burns cleaner than ethanol and the flame is not visible at all. Ethanol or methanol fire is considered very dangerous because it burns colorless and smokeless. If you cannot see it, you could very easily find yourself enveloped in fire before even you realize it. Many firefighters have actually died in such invisible fireballs and now they have completely different approach and protocols to extinguish ethanol and methanol fires. So that's it for today. Hope you learned something new. If so, do subscribe. See you in the next one.